hi guys and welcome back to my channel even though this intro is a little bit different from what i normally do but we went shopping today at ross for some back to school stuff for right now it's not a lot of stuff but it's a little bit of stuff that i end up picking up today for the kids them and um i'm gonna pick up some jeans and stuff but i'll show you what i picked up today also in this video i am gonna do a whole house clean y'all my house is a complete mess it's like the the crap the throw up in my house and it's a mess there's crap everywhere <laughs> so um also guys if you're new welcome and thanks for being here and for returning subscribers thank you so much for returning to my channel and guys if you're new um i'm gonna introduce myself my name is kidding and on my channel guys you will find motivation cleaning decluttering and organizing and so much more i'm also gonna start with some vlogging because i need to do some more stuff to um up my views and my subscribers because right now i'm trying i'm trying my best to go so much because i'm stuck at what three something i'm trying to go to 500 like i said i'm trying to do a 500 giveaway when i get there so if you guys don't mind please go ahead and share my videos to your friend from a loved one um let them uh just, um, just share it out there so like if you can see my videos because i'm like trying my hard even like sometimes i just want to like stop doing this youtube stuff because it's so frustrated you guys know you guys are youtubers it is frustrated to like clean 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 here that you're doing best but somehow people um even though they do subscribe even though they do um yeah i'm talking even though i'm um, uh a lot of people like uh, your content is good your content is blah, blah 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 but they're not subscribing and please hit that subscribe button so you guys will not miss any future updates any updates come anything um, also, before I get tongue tied and get away with all this, because I can't talk, I, I can't talk, I can talk your ears up. But like I said, I am, I'm going to also introduce, um, also start doing some vlog as well. Like, I'm going to do some cleaning, some vlog back, like, when my kids are going back to school, what I do, when my kids are here. Like, so let's have a conversation with you guys and just talk and show what I do, what I don't. I'm going to also start... Like, I'm thinking I'm going to do some cooking or something like that. But I know for sure I'm going to also do some vlogging on this channel as well. So, again, I'm going to go ahead and jump right in here and show what I picked up from Ross. So, if you guys like it. It was, like I said, it wasn't a lot of stuff. I went to just a little bit of stuff. And I also have when I walked through the store. Even though I think that part's going to be a little bit crazy. But I'm going to show what I picked up so far. First, on the docket, um, I picked up this... Uh, arrangement it's like a long arrangement i want something to go underneath that small table right there because it's kind of blah right now and i think this one is like every day so you can you can use it year around you can like put like red white especially like you have some christmas coming up whatever i know i'm far off right <laughs> coming up so and this one i only pay 16.99 for this one which is not bad and i, I really love it because like i said i can put it on the table it can be it can um fit anywhere you want it to go so i picked this up so it wasn't bad and for my son, I picked up some, like I said, I picked up some school shorts for him for school. Because he can't wear whatever shorts he have. I don't know. Yeah. It stretches. And this one's $5.99. Like I said, not bad. And it's also not really a drawstring. I thought it was a drawstring. Hmm? Yeah, I thought it was. But it's not. And he's so, he's tall and he's skinny. So I think this can fit him. I think. If it not, we probably could return and get something bigger. But this is a size 4 for him. And I also pick up this other one. This is the stretchy one as well. So this also says, and I pay four ninety nine for this one. Um, and also for my daughter, this the only thing I want. For my for my daughter, she picked up this um baggy shorts. I, I don't know what I call these. This is so this big. is a paper bag waist shorts. It's I guess it's what's in right now because I see up there like Ross. Guys, I'm telling you, Ross have so much stuff. It's like so hard to, um, I don't think it's so big. I know she keep on, she's behind the camera, keep on saying so big, but I don't think it's too big. It's, cause she, it's a large, so she should be fine and she have most room to go. The, like I said, this stuff is for school. For her to go to school and stuff like that. If it was okay with the teacher or whatever, then she can go to school. But if not, we're going to see. Um, it's called the paper bag shorts waist. So yeah, she get this for herself. And like I said, I pick up some more shorts for school. Same one like the first one, but this is the gray one, and then I have the light color one. So this is the same thing. I paid six ninety nine for this one. And this pants, this one, it's this was, uh, da, 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 I think it was thirty two dollars. This shorts was 
$32 and it's by Buffalo it says Buffalo David Rotland yeah okay yeah it's yeah it was $32 for these shorts and I paid six ninety nine for it from Ross oh I had it before same thing yep. everything mm -hmm. all right if you guys hear me I was talking to her about there so this one um before my camera decided to run into space and I gotta clean it up and whatever this one is 0 19 and this I pay seven seven ninety nine for this one and the original price for this bad boy if I can find it I don't think they do they probably took it off bang bang doo -doo -doo. but I'm yeah it's 0 19 but I'm not sure there's no it's an athletic fit and I paid um, $7.99 for this one. I'm not sure what the regular price is because it's not here on this one. Um, but yeah, this one I paid wasn't bad. It's really cute. It has the zipper and stuff right here where he can go. It says hustle in the pockets. And if you guys can see on the pocket, it says hustle. So, hustler, not hustle. And then I pick up another, well. Same thing. It's what happens when you're doing stuff. They have to be on their baking call, right? Yeah, that happens in real life. So, and this one, also, this is... Why does that look so... Uh, this is a VIP jeans. And this one, I paid $15.99 for this one. Look, it looks cute though. <laughs> for this one, and I think... Not sure what's the regular price for this bad boy is, but sometimes they it's have not, it's, it's behind the tag sometimes one. they do, but sometimes they don't. I'm mean, yeah, I'm like it's behind them. the tag. You just picked it up. It's a size in here. Ooh, not sure what the price is for the regular price for this. That's one. fifteen. I remember that was fifteen. I just said fifteen ninety nine. Yeah, I'm looking for the regular price because everything is marked down when you go to different places wholesale. But it's a, I paid 15 fifteen nine fifteen nine and nine for this one. I'm not sure what's the regular price for this one. Like I said, it's called VIP jeans. It's not bad. It's have a cargo pocket, high waisted, so it's like a jeggings stuff. So I said these half of these stuff like back to school. I know then was still like this wasn't even like all of it. Like it really wasn't. Because I know next month, because I go back to school next month, so I know for sure probably get more stuff for them and like more sh uniform shirt because we, they wear uniform here in um, school down here. I'm not sure about high school if they change because I know your high school they used to wear uniform shirt but I'm not sure. sure. And this one is the cargo jeggings and this one is $17.99. Uh, this top right here says $25 but I'm not sure for the value of the price. But this one I paid $6.99 for this one. It's also hers again. And it also have the leggings on the back. And it is really cute. Because you mm -hmm. can't have it. Because I don't want you to wear no tight pants, no booty shorts. No, I'm not like a mother who make my kids walk out the house and, um, what you, uh, what you call it? To each his own. Because that's your kid. But as my, as my kid, I don't want to go to school with, like those booty shorts. I've even noticed kids, like little young girls, 16 or 15, 13, 12, would they turn around their, uh, their, their ASS's showing while they're walking? But and you just to me you give yourself you give yourself okay people look at you and come no you ain't gonna walk out of my house something like that so no so and i pick up this because i need that extra one for my bed because i only have two and i end up picking up this mm -hmm. one also only one is like so velvety and soft and i pick up an extra one mm -hmm. and this one was 8.99 which is not bad i wanted the pair but i don't think they had it what's next i pick up this one and i picked up this black and white one from my living room. And this one was $10.99. Originally it was $20 to pick this up right now. Because what I'm gonna do today, I'm gonna um, change my current to black and white. I'm gonna keep my living room as a black and white theme throughout the entire rest of the season. Everything's gonna be black and white through here. So I'm gonna throw my entire, it's gonna flow right in through black and white or yellow, whatever it is, because colors um, go together. So I'm gonna put my, I'm gonna change my curtain today in this video. And I'm just gonna get a put, had this today. I was trying to find a matching one, but they have the matching one. But this is, it was instead of black, this was green. And I'm the one to put green. I want another matching one. So and I was just picking up one of these. So hopefully when I go back, they have a matching one for this. But yeah, this is um gonna be the ending for this part of this video. But I'm not gonna do no more talking to this entire cleaning video. It's gonna be a whole house.
clean with me speak clean with me so to speak so guys if you like what you see please don't forget to hit that subscribe button leave a comment down below and like i said share comment and if you guys are new let me know where you guys are watching from and if this is your new if this is this is your new if this is your first time here please let me know where you're watching from um let me know if it's like i say like i know it's your first time here and so on and so forth and i really love to have you here as part of my youtube family it's amazing guys we never get disappointed or get bored when i'm cleaning like i said i love what i do and i really hope you guys love what i do as well but like from here on out i'm not going to no more talking this is like my beginning so i'm going to go ahead and jump to the other half of my video now have a wonderful day and i'm going to jump right in on my cleaning all right guys on this part of this video i am going to be like i said doing my living room like this is the beginning of this video i was talking a whole lot <laughs> and um because i went to um ross not Ross, yes, to pick up some school stuff for my kids. Um, but I didn't get a lot because there's, first my first of all, my oldest one is so picky. And some of the stuff she picked, she didn't really like it or she does. So she really didn't get a lot of stuff. She got, like, like I showed you guys earlier, she got like, three pants. You should only get pants. So I have to go back in the following week to get some more stuff. But um, anyway, um, I must go ahead and start off in my living room. As you can see, my living room was a complete disaster. And I was like, oh, so it's not messy. But to me, it is messy because a little bit of stuff drive me bananas. I'm not sure why. My husband was like, oh, my God, you're so OCD. But I don't think it is because I'm not that drastic. There's nothing wrong with anything with um, OC or any OCD or anything like that. But I'm not. I just like to have a somewhat clean house because you can't have a clean house when you have kids running around because it would never be clean and i don't care what nobody say you will never have a clean house when you have kids unless you're like one that parent that once you clean your kid can't stand sit you can't sit in the chair you gotta go sit in the corner no i'm not that mom if i'm gonna clean i'm gonna clean but then i know it's gonna mess because it's lived in it's lived in we traffic back and forth it's living so I'll, I'll keep on saying you guys give me work to do every single day but i don't mind so i'm just going ahead and tie up this part of the um my living room right now and move it from there
going to be changing the curtain in the living room I'm trying to get it I'm doing my living room black and white throughout and I still need to get the one for the sliding door in the back there so I'm gonna go ahead and change it out and it brightens up I don't know it makes the room come alive which is crazy just like yellow like yellow is my favorite color all year round that I can't put yellow in the living room all year round. So I decided to change the atmosphere or um my entire living room around so I'm just go ahead and change this curtain put up my black and white curtain and I'm also gonna get like as you see I have this I need some more um black and white cushion I'm probably gonna order from Amazon because Amazon is where everything I tend to order even though I was told to get off Amazon by my husband but yeah it's not gonna happen so <laughs> I'm gonna order some more stuff because I need some more um the little more decoration I don't want to do too much in the living room because I don't like when the living room is cluttered I like to be like breathing room like a little bit of space here and there I don't like too much going on because the living room is not that big as a matter of fact and I'm trying to make it be comfortable but yet yeah, still looking good I'm not big on like decor or anything but I'm do I know enough to get me comfortable like, all right this look good here but this doesn't look good here just to make everything look all right it looks good let's move on from there cleaning up this table up because that following day like I said we went a um, little bit of clothes shopping and I just leave everything the way it is so I'm just going ahead and pick up all the uh, catch all so to speak because I just drop everything off that morning and leave out the house as quick as we can because I didn't want to spend the entire day on the road first of all it was so hot that day it's sometimes when it um because we've been getting rain forever and the rain and the heat and it was like it was like 11 or it was 11 o'clock that morning and I was trying and the minute you open that door you feel like um, you been get hit with a heat wave out of nowhere, and I was like, "Oh my God, not today!" But I just, like I said, I just want to get up early, get the kids out of the house for a while, for them to pick whatever they want, and we did accomplish it and come back. We end up getting some food from Chick Fil A, 
is it Chick-fil-A? Yeah, Chick-fil-A in that day. So um, they were eating while I was trying to clean up this living room because normally when they're well, normally when they're eating, they're sitting on the table. Today I said, like, you know what? Just go around, do whatever, and eat until I finish. I'm just cleaning up this living room. And that take that little um flower thing on the table that I end up picking up for my living room. It didn't fit, so I'm gonna end up transferring it to my. <laughs> in my bedroom just trying to get it, um make get the bed made up and tidy it up a little bit it wasn't that bad the only thing was over there as you can see my husband at night time he have to have his water bottle it doesn't matter how many water bottles he could have one from the prior day before he have to have a fresh cold water bottle every single night and it gets so accumulated over there that every morning i have to take the entire bottle out pour them out because he would not if it, he wouldn't drink it again so what i have to do i have to like pour out that half a drink but sometimes he will drink it up during the night but then again sometimes he's very if it depends if he's tired then he won't get up that often to drink but he have to have water he's like water he's like a camel him and my boys him love water which is amazing i'm surprised because my daughter is not a water fan i have to force her to drink water and they're both like just like the father drink water a lot so i'm gonna go ahead and make my bed up and change out my pillowcase to match my um my bed and move on from there <laughs> move on now to my dresser i'm just gonna go ahead and clean it off and get him or organized and set that little floor that i purchased from ross on the stable and just move on from there just gonna get it clean up because like i said it wasn't that dirty just a little bit of stuff thrown on everywhere so i'm just gonna go ahead and organize this not really organize just close back this drawer because whenever my husband opened this drawer he never closed it back all the way he half closed it but then when you walk in by either hit your knee your ankle or something so i'm just gonna go ahead and clean it up and get this all this space all neat and tidy
No, I'm off in the boys' and bedroom. You see that mess? Yes. I recently cleaned, when I say clean, deep clean this room so much. Every toy, everything. So, but what I end up doing, because they end up having the little organizer in the room, and I realize it, they keep on taking out everything and throw it underground. So, what I end up doing, I end up ordering more um, organizing bins instead of organizing the organizer put this little small bins in and, and um end up ordering one of those big bins to throw all their toys it's much easier for them to clean up their room instead of taking out i don't know where anything organized goes so i end up just getting one as is my hand right there i ordered from amazon it was like 10 it was 9.99 from amazon and it was a good size because they have a lot of space and it's foldable it, it can do everything so i end up getting one of them so as you can see they're helping me cleaning up their room and right now it really organized because when they take stuff out they just put it back in that bin and it's so much better for them as i can see it helps them um not forget it was in their toys on the ground so they just put all the toys in that bin and all the other and i end up ordering um another one from walmart and it end up coming like a small basket so all their toys is much better so much better for them to play with without getting a little individual organizer for their room so they're right now they're just cleaning up with me so every once in a while my little one will help me clean up the room but my older one he's like mostly to himself so to speak so that day i say you know what let's get up and help me because since y'all make the mess y'all head up and help me clean up this room so right now he just they're just helping me clean up their mess and everything so much organized and i'm taking out the more the bigger organizer shelves and give them more room they right now they have so much more room to play and i think that's that's something really good for them to do so yeah present his old school paper because my little one just ripped the entire paper down this is the reason why i or take that big organizer out of the room because he keep on going in all his papers and this mess and they were all torn or pieces missing so i just go ahead and go through the most important ones and put them away and the one that he doesn't really need anymore i just rip them up and put them in the trash bag so it much better for me not to worry where what all papers were and everything was organized so i'm just going through each paper right now to get rid of them and put in the trash and also guys if you're still here with me thank you so much for be sticking here with me leave me a pink emoji let me know you're still here with me guys and i'm trying to slow down and my talking like i said i do talk fast i'm trying to get that under control but it's gonna be it's gonna take some while but like i said it's my accent and i'm not gonna be like all um perfect for i try to change for no one i'm me and i really hope you guys like the person that you hear on the background or the person that i am because i really love my accent and i'm not going to change it for no one like i said but i am trying to slow down so you guys understand me more okay so again if you're here with me thank you for sticking with me even though this video is like a 45 minute long video it's a long one and like i said this one thing because i end up start cleaning a little bit later in the day because i end up 
like I said, went shopping with my kids and come back and started cleaning up my living room. So again, thank you so much for sticking there with me and just hanging out with me. And if you want more motivation, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button so you will get notified each time I upload. Thumbs up to the video and share with your family and loved ones. So I'm going to still right now jump back in cleaning this mess of a room and just get it all organized and sit away for them to play and have more room. Okay, my loves now I'm off to the kitchen I leave that for the last because I know it takes me the longest to get organized and clean and just put stuff away because that previous day like I said I um I end up just not feeling because normally I do dishes at night time for some reason because I want to wake up to a clean kitchen but that day I wasn't feeling like doing anything pregnant after cooking and if you're wondering what's on the stove what I end up doing I end up um putting some uh barkeeper's friend on there with some dawn detergent and some uh clorox to 
pick it up because you know when you cook and you leave it you have the little ring around the little dark ring around the stove so i was trying to get that up and i'll have it over there it was on there for a while um soaking up or whatever it was doing and it was greasy so i just put that on the stove to get it while i end up doing different stuff like um clean up the counter and try to get all these dishes put away but as we're heading to the end of this video i just want to say thank you guys for always coming back to show me some support i really do appreciate each and every one of you for just hanging there with me every single week like i said i'm changing the dates if i haven't said that before i do apologize but i'm changing the days of my uploading days i'm only going to upload tuesdays and friday from now on because weekends i'm trying to spend more time with my kids i don't want the weekend or the week to get away because like i said i don't want to um differ from not spending time with them because they're going back to school the summer is almost up and all i do is wandering cleaning throughout the week and i'm trying to separate my my family from my cleaning content constantly so i'm just gonna go ahead and give myself a break myself a peace of mind and upload those two times a week it is tuesdays and fridays at 8 a.m so please let me know in the content in content if you guys don't stick around with me for that because i'm gonna do this for myself because i do get overwhelmed and frustrated because sometimes you get just want to you get worn out so to speak you do and i'm getting worn out so i just keep those weekends for my kids and to give me more time to prep and wonder what my content is going to be throughout the week so those are my dates for now until I see more and I'm also gonna start introducing some more ghost haul in this channel as well I'm thinking about doing a vlog channel but I'm gonna wait until this channel reach somewhere before I end up taking up a next project on my hand so again if this is a content that you like please don't forget to hit that subscribe button leave a leave me a comment down below let me know where you guys are watching from and I oh know I'm sorry I'm talking because my little one is in my hand trying to get some nap Again, let me know where you guys are watching from and leave me some house emoji in the end and let me know you guys are here to the end. And guys, like always, I will see you guys in my next one and I love you guys to the moon and back. Have a blessed and amazing week, guys, and happy Tuesday. Bye, guys. Have a wonderful one. And thanks so much for watching again. And from all your subscribers, thank you. I really, really appreciate you guys. And my return, like, um, the new subscribers, thank you for clicking on my channel, coming over and just supporting me. It meant, like, if I could give you guys all hugs, I really would. Like, I'm giving some hair hugs. Thank you so much, guys. Have a wonderful day. Bye. Thank you.